In this video, we'll balance the equation for SbCl2 gives us this SbCl3. This is antimony plus chlorine gas. So let's count the atoms up, balance the equation. We have one for Sb, two for Cl, and then on this side we have one and three. So when we end up with this odd number here, it's usually easiest to get this to be an even number. So if I put a two as my coefficient, one times two, that would give me two, but three times two, that would give me six. So now all I need to do to balance the chlorine atoms is put a three here, two times three, that'll give me six, and then a two, one times two, that gives me two, and we're done. This equation is balanced. The key here, when you have that odd number of chlorines, try to get that to an even number. That should make it easier to balance. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for Sb plus Cl2. Thanks for watching.